Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome to another episode. It is the last day of fishing in Quebec. Today is the last day of the season and it is cold, it's raining, it's poopy out here. But uh, we, we saw in the last video what kind of walleye are hiding out here. We just went on Friday. So uh, we're going out again for the final round. But uh, the other problem is, if you guys remember, I explained in the last video, the water at the ramp was really high. Well, it's about 20 feet high. Well, okay, not 20 feet higher, but it's 20 feet further up the ramp, making it even more challenging to try and get the boat off of the trailer. So we're going to give it a shot. Mark is joining me again today, of course, and uh, we'll see how it goes. We're going to be doing the exact same thing as last time. We're going to be looking for slack water uh, and throwing drop shots and jigs, and we're going to see at what depth the uh, fish are at, so we're gonna be doing everything from 15, even 10 feet, right to 40 feet. We're gonna see if we can find us some fish. But if it's been like it has been in over the last week or so, um, the smaller fish are deeper and the bigger fish are in the 20 foot, 15 foot area. So we're gonna give it a shot and we'll see how it goes. So stay tuned, join us, and uh, again, we'll give some tips and uh, you'll get to see it live, what it's like fishing for these monster walleye. Hopefully today we get something over 10 pounds. We want, we're looking for a double digit fish. So join us and uh, let's see how it goes, all right? Let's do it. Okay guys, see the sign way over there that says danger, right there, boop, 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 boop. That is where the boat launch starts. So that's basically where the uh, concrete ramp starts. Uh-huh, this ought to be fun. Things are... uh, do you want any of this for your bait? Uh, I'll use this for now. Okay. Oh, that's a covey of cars. Look at you go, boy. No depth of fire. Oh, take Ooh. your time, take your time. Okay, already starting with the tanks. Oh, we're all, oh okay, you oh. woke up. I'm not locked in. Well, that was fast. <laughs> <you so long>. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not locked in. Oh, yeah, okay, lock her in. It's okay, there you go. Well, that was quick. Good job, man. Booyah. Well, that was quick. There you go, guys. <laughs> yep. We were just starting the drift. We weren't even in the zone yet and already starting. Seven, two. There we go. Cool. All right, buddy. I'm not turning this off. You will. All right. See you, bud. Nice. Thank you. What did I tell you? It looks like a seven pounder. It might be six and a half. <laughs> <laughs> Booyah. Hey, hey, hey. Right. New, new personal best. That, first fish. That right there is worth coming out. First minute, first fish. New per, new personal best. I just want to know what took you so long. I'm sorry. I know it took me more than a few minutes there. And I mean, he smoked it. I was like, why am I stuck already? <laughs> <laughs> there you go, guys. On the red again with some of that liquid mayhem. All right, guys. Put in your comments below. Do you believe in that first cast, first catch, your curse for the day? I want you to post in the comments below. Tell me if you believe in that or not. Mark over here doesn't believe in anything. He's not worried about bananas. The first catch, what direction the wind is, he doesn't care. You really wanted that bag, that bad? Unbelievable. I caught me a free bag. Mark's got himself something. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Mark's got himself a fisty fish. Oh, yeah, keep up. All right, well, we're gonna have to take this out because this thing is not gonna take on. All right, Mark, what, what you got on? <laughs> I got moldy. You got a sturgeon? Is it fighting? Has it got head shakes? Oh, what the hell is that? Wow. Probably some jigs on that puppy. You're gonna get the corona with that for sure. Like hey guys, sorry, uh, camera wasn't going and of course I caught one. <laughs> yeah, let's get the board to see if he's a keeper. Get that out of your mouth, dummy. Thank you. It is a juicy 16. 
Nice. He's the keeper. Going in the box. Alrighty. God, that's a sign of life. I felt pressure. I'm on again. Nice. Better fish if I'm not stuck. Got any head shakes or is it just dead? No, it's just dead. It's probably not, not a fish. Then. It's coming up. You, you should have some head shakes if you don't have Oh, there. Oh, oh. Okay, it's a big oh, one. Oh, oh, Christ. Okay, it just woke up, whatever it is. Very cool. Okay, that's something big. Something, something? Uh, that'll be the biggest fish I've caught so far. Oh. It's a musky. It's musky. Is it? Bring it up. Oh my oh, god! No. It's looking giant cat. <laughs> that is a giant catfish. You're on your own. Holy jeez. <sighs> <sighs> okay. Oh. Well, I did. I don't know how much this thing weighs. <laughs> Look at this thing. All right. All right, guys. There you go. Big catfish. We're going to let her go. There you go. See ya. Yeah. <laughs> Holy jeez. How'd you think that was a musky? When it came up, I just saw like long and thin. Uh. So I knew it wasn't a walleye. <sighs> and I thought I saw like a silver flash for the car. I thought it was a small. <sighs> huh? That wasn't a small musky. That was a big ass nasty catfish. There we go. You're on? Got yourself another catfish? All right, Mark's on now. Is it big, whatever it is? This is big, whatever it is. We found the catfish. Oh, well, I laughed at you, now you're gonna laugh. We found us the catfish. That's a walleye. That's a walleye, dude. Oh, you snagged us. It's a big walleye, though. That ain't no catfish, Mr. Paranoid. All right, dude. See you later. That's a nice one. We'll take it. We'll take it. Well, we're not taking it, but we're taking it. Better to be wrong, we have a wall. It's a good one. Good keeper. I didn't even have time to put my bait back on yet. What the? You made me get the net for that? Well, you had nothing better to do. I was. I do. I'm trying to put my bait on. You're distracting me with your little minnows. That sounds like a personal problem. Catch a real fish. Mark's on again. I still don't have my bait on. One thing I do know, it's not a catfish. Not a catfish, are you sure? Not a catfish. I know you want a catfish. Uh, no, I'm good. You've been jealous of my catfish. Honestly, I'm... That's too big, I think, for your keeper. Oh, I think he might be a bit long. <laughs> Anytime you want to let me fish, let me know. Tell me I'm wrong. So, he's too big. He es escaped by a quarter of an inch. All right, here we go. Mark's found the mother load. They like me, Jay. I'm on. He's gonna be water skiing in a minute here the way we're going. Don't be a bit too small. Too small. I'm sure it's too small, but measure it anyway. Oh, it's a keeper. Live well. Barely, but you're a keeper. In you go, buddy. That's a better one. It's probably because it weighs a ton. No, it's a big wall. Come on, big mama. Well, it... oh, it's getting mad. It's a big walleye. Oh, <laughs> oh no. no, not another oh, cat. And it just took off. The catfish king, my friends. Forget the king of the tigers. I know you like looking for pussy. But come on now, enough <laughs> is enough, will you? Where is it? Oh, there. All right, so we just caught a giant catfish, but the camera froze again. I don't know, but I'm catching the heck out of these catfish. All you noodlers out there, eat your hearts out. Are you on another fish, Marcus? I'd be on another one. That is most definitely not a monster. This one's gonna need a minute. Uh oh, Mark's got another big in. I ain't got time for phone calls. This better not be a catfish. Uh oh, Mark's got a cat. Don't be worried. It, it's, it's fighting like a walleye. It just tightened the line though. Whatever it is, it's got some weight. Don't see a meow meow. Be a catfish. Come on, catfish. No, this is a big walleye. It's a big catfish. Anytime. I'm up to the school. Get ready. Oh! oh that, that, a big one. 
That could be it. Guys, we might have caught our 10 pounder. Wow. Holy, okay, here we go. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. All right, here we go. Do we hit the 10? Yep. All right. I don't think it is. She is. She's like eight and change. Seven, seven, eight. Seven pounds, oh yeah, seven pounds, eight ounces. Boom. Good to go. Bye, baby. That looks bigger than a seven eight. All right, guys, so just to explain what we're doing here, and I'm sorry I can't use the big camera because it's still pouring rain, but what we're doing here is we're working an area where there's a big drop off. So again, it's slack water, and there's a big drop off in front of us that goes from about 12 feet, 10 feet, to about 35 feet. And we're just throwing and drop, bringing everything down the drop. The drop off's in front of us, we're just dragging down the face of it. We're not doing too much. Mark's got his jig combo going on, and I've got the drop shot on. And that's it. And we're barely doing anything. We're just ticking it off because the uh, the current is bringing it towards us to make sure we don't get stuck in any rocks every once in a while. Give it a little hop. That's about it. And I'm on. Just like that, guys. Just like that. That is not a catfish. Better not be another damn catfish. Not, that's definitely not a catfish. That's no catfish, my friends. Uh-huh. No pussy there, dude. That ain't no catfish. That is a big old walla. A uh, little too big to keep, unfortunately. The hook Hello. just the hook just broke. Hello. Look at this. The hook just broke at the shaft. I blame you. Okay, well I gotta get this out of his mouth. <laughs> well, we doubled up. Mark, uh, that's uh, your fish seems a bit smaller than mine. What is that little? Is that is that a perch? I think it might be a perch. All right, guys, let's let him go. See you, bud. Booyah! Hey, mystery tackle box. Why are your drop shot hooks snapping? Oh, look, a parasite fell off him. Gross. Look at that. Look at the worm. Eh, no biggie. Ugh. Okay, well, I gotta retie. Mark just hooked something. I'm retying. Mark just hooked up something as he's reeling up. Decides to nail something. Oh, God, my scale's getting all soaked. Yeah. Pets' heads are I'm falling off. I'm betting on catfish this time. Did you catch yourself a catfish? That is not a walleye! Way to go, buddy! The surgeon is about to go to work. Got him right in the tail. How many of these things are down there? Mm -hmm. Get him, Mark, get him. There we go. I also noticed that your catfish was significantly smaller than mine. So much action. All right, let's see if I can finish tying this up. Taking okay, over. I've literally, over I didn't even finish tying. I just said, I'm, I hope he lets me finish tying. I happen. literally just put the drop shot weight on and guess who's hooked into another if, big catfish. This isn't a catfish. This is a mongoloid walleye. This is big, but I got a bad feeling. <laughs> that is a bad, I don't know what this is. Guys, forget this video being about catching monster walleye. Today it's giant catfish. It's big, whatever this is. Mongo. Last time I reeled to the drop shot. I don't want to do that this time. Oh! Musky. Oh my god. Oh! <laughs> Guys, we just caught a monster monkey. Monster musky. <laughs> Holy buckets. Okay, he's mad. Hang on, hang on. Without him spinning. Holy. Oh my God, this is he ate my drop shot. Holy. Guys, I don't know if you can see this. I'm freaking out. Look at the head on this thing. I gotta get his mouth open to get this out. <laughs> where's the Where's the pliers? I don't want to touch nothing. I'm gonna open his mouth with Just this? Just barely, because he's gonna kick. Guys. <laughs> oh. Oh my God. <laughs> Hold on. I'm sorry. Give me a second. I'm working on it. Okay, okay, go, go. What? Okay, look at me, look at me. One, two, three. Okay, we're good. I'm gonna record video. Go. Okay. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. My God. <laughs> you do know that was a 40 pounder, right? Eh? Oh my God, dude. You know that was a 40 pounder. That was a gigantic musky, guys. Even, because it was so slippery, I couldn't even pick it up properly. <sighs> Holy crap. Hey guys. <laughs> As you can see, things are a little insane right now. <laughs> we just parked on this spot and it was just like all of a sudden a switch got turned on 
and we're just casting over this ledge and it's just one thing after another. Walleye, we got catfish, and you saw that monster, that monster muskie. Guys, that's a 55, like 54 inch muskie, a 40 pounder. Did you see the size of that thing? That is a gigantic muskie. So this has been one heck of a day. Welcome to fishing on the St. Lawrence. You never know what you're gonna catch. Anyway, so it's pouring rain. We're gonna put the big camera away, but we're just doing the same thing that I explained in my previous video. Just very slowly working the baits and uh, falling off that ledge in the slacker water where they're all hiding. And uh, man, we are just loading the boat. All right, let's get back at it. <laughs> okay guys, that was a little insane. <clears throat> like even I'm shaking from that thing. That is the biggest muskie I've ever seen in my life. That thing is a monster. Next up, I'm gonna get me a goose. Yeah. <laughs> For the record, this is the second time that Mark hauls out a monster muskie from the back of my boat. Just thought I'd mention that. And the gals themselves are something real big. Hey, we're on. We're on like Donkey Kong. How's it feeling? Like, oh, it came off. Oh, I'm still like freaking out. There's on. There you go, you bastard. Got you that time, you mean bastard. Yeah, baby. Stay on this time. There she is. Into the bait well. That's... Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. You're wonderful. There he is. That's a fatty. This is a perfect, nice keeper right here. Boom. Booyah. By the way, I do apologize if there's a lot of wind in the audio, but I cannot take the, can't put the external mic on because it's not waterproof. We're on. We're on again. It's another keeper. Maybe bigger than a keeper. There it is. Another beautiful keeper. Thank you, sir. There you go. Get them on the board. There you go, guys. Another beautiful keeper right there. Loading the well. Marcus got another one. This sucks when somebody's hooked up every cast. Seriously. It's I'm, not br that I'm, big. Just, I'm bringing it over here. That's all. In case, in case you need it, you know? There's just a beat down going on downtown. I'm on again. This one's far out. This is a boat swing fish. There you go, still an eater. Ooh, snap, another beauty. Less than 15. See ya. Go get bigger. And I can't even stop to eat. We're just catching too much. It's ridiculous. I gotta dig down. There you go. I gotta dig this a good one. I gotta just got bigger. All right. I'm not saying it's a... You got a snaggle tooth? There's a beaut! Nice there you go. Another beauty got for it. you. I think that's a little too big to keep, Mr. Mark. Uh, oh, this is a nice fish. Yeah. Oh. See ya. What the hell are you doing? Not good. <laughs> He's still on? Look! I last him. him. <laughs> Let the fish go, Mark. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Oh, I just got smacked and he laid. he didn't take it. And we on like Donkey Kong. A little keeper. Yeah, he's under. Oh, hey there. All right, now that I have five seconds to talk, I've done two co three color changes actually. We went to a black with blue uh, blue flake. We went with the chartreuse and white paddle tail, and I'm back on the orange. And that's what, everything I've caught is on that orange guy. Orange. Yeah, orange you glad? Orange you glad you went to orange? Yep, yep, yep. I'm on two. I got a little guy. Double header. Double header. What the heck is this thing? I'm not used to this. Look at this thing. I got the smallest walleye in the group. Where's that musky? I'll feed it. Can we hand feed musky? Now we gotta pay attention guys, something broke, broke apart upriver clearly. Cause we got a ton of ice coming down here. We got ice, got some big trees coming. So we're gonna have to keep an eye on the ball here, make sure we don't get smoked by something. What happened, it went to sleep? I, I, th I think something major broke apart and it's all just coming down here now. Well, there's some pretty big chunks coming there. So guys, just to show how crazy things can turn on and off, just, I broke off, retied, and now it's totally dead. Neither of us are catching anything anymore. Right place at the right time. 
with the right baits. Oh, that is so adorable. Let's see that monster. <whistles> Megan. I am going to stop to eat because I am starving. Big ass, big ass, nasty ass bird. Get out of here. That's right, get stepping. All right, guys, we got kicked out of our home, so <laughs> we're getting wrecked over there. Try here for a few minutes. This is trash. We'll, we'll be out of here. I think we're uh, pretty set to go. We are safely back on the trailer. Rather than talking to myself, guys, you are a soldier. Serious action today, guys. <sighs> Woo! Guys, that was a ridiculous bite wow well as you saw we got chased off the water mother nature said uh-uh no more go home so uh we had obviously something broke up something broke up further up up river it just started pouring logs and icebergs and all kinds of stuff so we had no choice we got off the water the wind started picking up the rain started pouring harder and the fish turned off it was like like this somebody just flicked a switch and that was it the fish were gone after that crazy two-hour flurry so uh, but that was an insane day and an insane way to finish the season this is the last day of the season now we're off until basically June Ugh. so what a way catching giant catfish the biggest muskie I have ever seen and I got a new personal best walleye uh, seven pounds three ounces so this was a hell of a day guys thank you so much for joining me I really really appreciate it as you can tell I'm completely pumped uh, so yeah I'm gonna get home get everything out go uh, dry everything off and we're out of here right take it easy guys have an awesome day tight lines all that good stuff stay safe stay healthy with all the craziness that's going on in the world and we'll see you guys on the other side all right take it easy peace